Danny Segura for MMA Fighting here in Coconut Creek, Florida at, Ameri at the American Top Team headquarters. I'm joined by UFC fighter Marina Amoroz. Uh, Marina, last time we saw you, um, what was a bit ago, was in March. You defeated Sabina yeah, Maso. Yeah, um, I have March fight. I know you were supposed to fight in August, but you suffered an injury and, and you weren't able to, to fight in August. Um, first of all, how, how is that injury going? Are you 100% recovered? Uh, I have problem with my elbow. I have sparring uh, three weeks to, uh, before fight, and uh, one guy uh, hit me kick in my elbow, and it's problem with nerve, and I can't work. I, I won't fight, but my uh, manager say and coaches we sit down and talk, and he say no fight because big problem with my arm, elbow. I don't feel my finger, wow. and yeah, I not train one. Um, months uh, no I train but I you know train no work my arm yeah uh, just uh, work my leg um, kick uh, condition but no not um, train arm yeah. how is it now uh, uh, I, I feel better training. yeah I uh, fast recovery um, I, I believe I uh, I know I feel will be feel good and um, uh, try work but sometimes I feel uh, discomfort I feel uh, yeah. a little bit pain but I concentration and slow slow now I start uh, sparring and I won't fight uh, December but I talk talking my manager manager and I think my fight will be uh, next year I don't know but I, I won't fight soon I, I missed uh, Octagon, I won't fight, I, I, I love fight, I enjoy. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> yeah. So um, in your last fight you beat Sabina Maso, uh, great performance. Um, you, were, you went up a weight class, you were fighting at, at flyweight. Um, how did you feel fighting at 125 Oh, pounds? I feel great. Um, before I, I cut a lot of pounds in 115, and feel weakness um, for me hard and sometimes when I cut weight uh, 115 I scared scared because I so skinny uh, I don't have muscle now uh, when I cut 125 I feel uh, good I eat healthy I eat carb uh, and um, have more energy and, and, and how bad were your cuts to uh, to straw weight because it, it is 10 more pounds that's a lot 10 pounds? No. Uh, I cut one, 115, I cut, I think, yeah. 20 pounds. 22, 20, a lot. Uh, now I can cut 15, um, 12, not yeah. too much. It's sometimes 10, yeah. yeah. For me, 10 pounds is easy. And, and so. when you said um, scary, you know, going down to 115, like what were some of the things that you were like, oh, I, I don't like this, like I don't like dropping so low? In UFC have before only one um, um, division, 115 yeah. or 135. 35, yeah. yeah, and 45 for me big, to girl big, mm -hmm. girl cut weight too much, and I need cut weight 115. And um, I, I, I have uh, after cut too much um, injury. Uh, yeah. Pain, my knee, uh, everything, you know, it's problem with stomach, um, a lot, and I don't want back in 115. <laughs> yeah. So, 115 days over? Yeah, I think yes. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe, you know, it's sport, but right now I feel good and better 125 yeah. for my uh, life. Yeah. So I'm gonna call you out because before we started this interview, you said your English wasn't that good, but it's it's really good. Yeah, thank you. Because uh, I talk it with coach. Uh, I have a lot of friends. I started uh, learning uh, Portuguese. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, a lot of Brazilians good. here at, at yeah, American Top Team. Yeah, but I try to uh, learn English and I like it. For English, sure. yeah. Yeah, and uh, it seems that 125 pounds, the media, the fans look at the champion Valentina Shevchenko as someone that's almost, uh, you know, invincible, like super dominant. Um, as a fighter, from a fighter perspective, how, how do you see the champion? Do you see 
her having any holes. What do you make of, of Valentina, the, the champion? She she good fighter. She very good. She good striking. Uh, she um, good wrestling, jiu jitsu, everything. But uh, I I want I walk in. I won't fight b for the belt, and I believe. And I know she very good, very very good. And she for me, Joanna, Valentina for me, my motivations. And I look in how girl train, and for me it's a push. And I I walk in concentration train, sometimes pain, injury, but I not stop and uh, follow. Yeah. And uh, you told me you've been living in Florida already for a year, um, right? Yeah, 11, 11, months, 11 months. So yeah. How do you how do you like it, and what's your favorite I, thing about Florida? Yeah, I love I love um, weekend ocean beach, relax. It's enjoy um, here very beautiful zoo zoo. Um, and I like. Um, here hot everything yeah yeah very. <laughs> then not cold because i live in ukraine right now cold yeah, yeah. yeah. and i enjoy i love here yeah it's florida's really, great for some yeah. reason i don't know if you know but here in the states a lot of people hate on florida for some reason but florida is a, is a but, great state yeah but uh, first uh, four months i drive bike every day uh, for coming ah. gym 30 minutes uh, 30 minutes in gym after 30 minutes back in home two times and oh my god it's so hot so tight but now i have car and i enjoy yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know some sometimes i drive car drive bike yeah uh, sometimes it's when it's nice good. Yeah. yeah nice for sure all right Marina, well thank you so much for your time uh best of luck in your recovery and can't wait to hear what's next for you uh, thank you thank you see you